What's that D stand for? Um... Hey everybody, Car Dreamer here, coming at you on behalf of D-Class and D-Class Derailed. And today we're bringing you another opening pseudo-unboxing. Uh, I did, as I mentioned in a previous video, this was actually the last one I was trying to get. Finally managed to get my hands on him. Um, super happy about that. So we're just going to make him the next one we open. So we're going to take a look at the Ninja Elite Series Raff in Disguise action figure from Playmates. And uh, take a look at how he is. And here we go. And just like Michelangelo that we did before. Um, so many points of articulation as far as the head does tilt a little bit up and down. Definitely does the side to side. Uh, I mean, articulations down in the ankles and even the toes. The knees, elbows, arms, shoulders. Uh, I mean, even each individual finger is articulated. And as I stated in the... Michelangelo video that is a pro and a con it's really a neat concept that they are articulated but they're not uber tight so sometimes Raf seems to be a little bit better than Mikey was Mikey it was the slightest little hit and the weapons fell out of the hands this one seems a little bit better uh so I give him props for that it's just a mixed bag when you want to you know do battles and the weapons are constantly falling out of the hands as opposed to old-fashioned where the hand joints were just permanent you know permanent grips whatever but I digress. Uh, I still like the look of him. I like his... I like the facial expression. I like that the fedora does come off. And as you can see, the fedora is shaped to fit a certain way. Uh, where the knot of the bandana would go, right there, where my thumb is. And as... And this jacket does come completely off of I want. This is actually just Velcro going down there it's hard to do that with one hand one day i'll invest in a tripod but it's also more fun to irritate certain viewers <laughs> but um but yeah it comes off so you don't have to have that on there if you want it just a plain turtle figure i feel like you don't need to do that as they make the figures just like this anyway without the jacket so it's kind of cool to just keep the jacket on plus i don't want the jacket getting ruined dirty or lost i'd just rather keep it on them but that doesn't mean i won't have fun uh Overall, I like this a little better than the Mikey. I think the Mikey had a cool expression. The nunchucks of the chain were good, but again, his hands just didn't hold as well. Raf's does, so he gets a little more props for that. Uh, until then, but yeah, so thank you all for watching. This has been uh, a look at the Elite Ninja Series Raphael in Disguise based on the first live-action Ninja Turtle movie from the 90s. The other ones were inspired by, because none of the other ones were ever shown wearing the trench coat. But it's inspired by, because Raph... And this one actually is, because Raph did wear the trench coat. So I thought that was pretty cool. Playmates, it's not... And for 20 bucks, I'm not going to complain. It's a $20 figure, and I think that's pretty decent. I can't... Yeah, I'm not going to argue that. So... doesn't come as many accessories as the old-school figures, but I guess it's... You know, give and take. You got way more articulation. It's a much nicer sculpt than back in the days. But, less variety in play. But anyway. Till next time, I'm Car Dreamer. This has been D-Class Derailed. Leave your comments down below. And until next time, stay evil.